You're listening to Mix Off Air with Duffy Moon, Amber K, Camper Kyle, and Kelsey Lorenz. And now, Dear Diary. Duffy's not here. <laughs> yeah, no, he's not. He's hiding. No, um, Duffy. I, I have a, an excerpt from a diary from an <laughs> event that happened recently. What? Whose diary? Oh, mine. Oh, oh okay. thank God. <laughs> Oh, Kyle, are you scared so did I you, found your diary? Like, did you get a hold of my sleep journal again? <laughs> yeah, really. Like, how'd you get in my house, first of all? Camper. Camper. Um, no, so the other day... So, okay, first of all, my New Year's resolution was to quit being, like, fake. You know, like, if I don't like someone, I'm just... I'm not going to act like I like them. That's fair. Or, you know, just that kind of thing, just to well, be you, real and You genuine. and I get along, though. I didn't mm-hmm. think you liked me. I thought well, this was an act. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, so, well, I, I wasn't on very long resolution. Yeah. So. <laughs> well, so I was out and about, I won't say where, and okay. this female that I just cannot stand Ooh. Walks, Ooh. walks by. Kelsey's like, oh, juicy. <laughs> and yeah. she was friendly and like kind of asked a question. And I was kind of like staring at her because when I don't like someone and I see them, I just kind of like you get that look. look at their eyes. Like I can't. I'm just like I hate you. You know, you get, like a twitch <laughs> so, going on. Yeah. And so she says something to me friendly and like kind of as a question, like joking. And I just looked at her and I just turned my head. Oh, oh my oh, goodness! Wow. And then I was telling my husband, I was like, ah. So and so just talk to me. Like, why would she try to talk to me? And he was like, I I can't remember what was it between y'all. Like what happened? And I was like, I just she's just not a good person. I just don't yeah, like her. Like, like her as a character. human. Wow. Yeah. Really good. <laughs> yeah. I mean, basically, she she did do something in high school. There we go. That I didn't like, but other than that, it's been to other people. Ah. But I just it's to other people, and so. I came to this realization as society, I think we should just treat bad people rudely. Yes. <gasps> like if you yes. know someone but- is a bad person, like like her favorite type of man is the married kind. Uh, She's one of those. Uh, right. Uh, so so I was about to, to say that's a little dangerous because the who decides who's the bad person, but in that case it's pretty obvious. In my and, man's safe. you know, when you certain things yeah. with your children oh. and just there's there's Definite people who just, when it's repeated behavior, mm. it's not like a one time, yeah. but it's like a repeated for decades yeah. type of thing. They're certifiable yeah. dirtbags. You're yeah. just, <gasps> yeah. Well, so in in our society, I should have, haha, whatever, responded, laughed, and been nice. She's never done anything to me. Sure. But I don't like her <laughs> as a right. human. Personally. Right. And so I just gave her a horrible look. And just turn my like whipped my head and I like do not speak to me type of thing. Oh, man. She was probably wondering why, you know. <laughs> yeah. But I think that we may because we're supposed to be friendly to people. When people are like that, we're just nice to them, and then we talk about them when they walk off. Yeah. And I was like, no, you know what? I'm gonna start being mean or to <laughs> people you know that what? are just not good people. And if they don't, if they get upset that I'm being rude to them, they should just be a better person. I do agree. <laughs> <laughs> they should just you, you fix should themselves. Just rethink your life. Uh, well, I don't I don't I think when you make all these decisions, but then sometimes you decide to be nice and you decide to be fake and friendly. There's a few of these girls I know. And then everybody feels like they need to be nice to you because right now you're like being a good person, but behind closed doors you're a bad person. If I know the stuff that you do I'm. I don't care how nice you are out in public. I'm mm. not going to be friendly to you. So what? What is the difference between being friendly and cordial? Like if you would have sat there and or didn't sit there, but yeah, if you would have laughed back, there you go. If it was just one of those, like, yeah, I don't like you, but See, I think maybe. that's kind of like the Amish. Like we should make it known <laughs> that we do not <laughs> like them. <laughs> You don't like the Amish? We I don't know, like the Amish. No, no like you the know Amish what? We sh- they'll shun people yeah, yeah. and just turn oh. their back. Like, Amber. I think we, we should, should make it. Straight up Game of Thrones it. 
Look, and just shame. Shame. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to start carrying a bell. Amber, but, just ring it. I think this is like the first philosophical thing we've ever agreed on. Really? Because I, I've always been about shunning bad behavior, like publicly shunning yeah. <laughs> bad behavior. There's, there's another female that she's like, <sighs> she's <laughs> successful in her career. Good. She's really super okay. pretty, really well put oh, together. Stop. Comes from a pretty well known family. <laughs> Who are you talking about? She's um, uh, really super friendly and bubbly and polite. And I know mm. things about her. And <laughs> I I'm like, you are is. not that person. That is all fake. And so when people say stuff about her in my presence, I let them know. Uh-oh. Oh. See, I, I'm I, like, well, oh, no, no. She is not who you think she is. So, that is all a fake persona she puts on because I've had personal experience with her. And Okay. Well, see, you did have a personal, like, experience. Yeah. But where is that line where you're, like, you're, you don't, you're not friendly, but you are cordial? Because I know, like... In mm-hmm. high school, people would be like super, super she, mean. Well, she's saying get rid of that line. Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, I don't believe in it. You're yeah. a bad person. Don't talk to yeah. me. <laughs> yeah, just, just leave. But like if you have to see that person on a regular basis. There is another person. Here we go. <laughs> oh boy. Let's just. Goodness. <laughs> this one did something very specific to me uh. personally. And it's just. Ugh, can't. Ugh, she's. I can't stand her. Very bad person. Oh, I can't. And when I see her. In public, because I do run into her. It's I just, a small town. I just look at her, and mm. I just turn my head. Give her the crazy She knows. Yes. She knows, and she'll just kind of look at me like she knows. Um, yeah, I usually always kind of, well, I mean, I don't know. I don't really, like, not, not like anyone. <laughs> I'm trying to think not, of. Not like anyone. I don't really not like I don't know. Because I, I feel like I still, like, how are you doing? Mm-hmm. Like, kind of do that, like, as we pass by. Like, I won't go out of my way to, like, talk. I, I try to go out of my way <laughs> with my face to let them know I do not like them. Oh, see. Two different tactics. No, I'm see. not talking about just a general person, but there are certain people that have done really bad things or, to, like, me and or my family. Just and I'm very them. loyal. Like, if Boom. you've done something to someone I'm mm. friends with, like... I I also hate you. There you know oh, that, yeah. <laughs> See, I'm I'm the kind of guy where if like my friend gets like screwed over or something, I'll go, "Ah, you got this, bud. Good luck." And then it, it's kind of just fun to See how he handles it. Someone asked yeah, me to yeah. take pictures of their, um, when, when I was doing photography, mm-hmm. to take pictures for, I think it was like their engagement or for family you pictures. You didn't mess it up. Did you and, mess them up? Oh, no, I messaged them and I oh. said, I'm sorry, but your now fiance or husband, I don't remember what it was, is my best friend's ex and did really bad things to her. So no, I'm not taking your picture. Well, I don't feel comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> and then another person wanted me to take pictures what? and I was like, you hooked up with my best friend, one of my friend's husbands. So no, I will not take your picture. Oh my goodness. Yeah. And I feel Who like you hang out with. I, really? I, I, well, I because I feel like if we, if as a society, we did that more, it wouldn't excuse their behavior oh, so much. Yeah. They would be more, yeah. mm. you know, leery about doing these things. Well, but they just get yeah. to go about their lives living normal because everybody's like, I don't want to be rude. You That's know, it's fair. like, well, it's dude, like, whatever. When it, my mom hit that age of not caring, <laughs> I, what? Like, did I hit, did I hit that age? You today might have today? just hit that age yeah. because she, she will even say, uh-huh. she'll tell me a story, say what she said. And I'm like, you didn't say that out loud. And she's like, I did, Kelsey, because I don't care. I was like, oh my gosh, Marietta, <laughs> all right. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, you go, name? girl. No. Well, and like, I had a best, I had a best friend growing up. We're still really good friends. It's my friend that lives in London. And we would fight so much. And we lived together in college and we would fight. But then because we just went at it and told each other what we were upset about or whatever we got over it and we went on and we're still friends but it's the ones that you don't you don't want any kind of you know confrontation confrontation and so then it just builds and builds and builds mm, and builds and yeah. so when you actually do just up front this is how i feel or you know i'm not gonna act mm. like i'm not upset or i'm not gonna act like i like you see if i'm pretty comfortable with the person i'll confront them but i like to just out of out of sight out of mind 
<laughs> See, I'm you're fine. you're more of an agreeable person than Amber is over here, and that's not a bad or negative thing on on either How side. How is that? Well, it's, it's a personality trait. It's disagreeable and agreeable. And uh, Amber is has the disagreeable personality trait where she's like, no, I'm not gonna handle. It I'm not gonna take sound... this. Oh. And but whereas you're more agreeable, so you're like, I'm just not gonna. You know, I'm just gonna pretend it'd be nice. I sound you know? weak. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Gonna start cool. Just no. Telling you know what? That she, yeah. No, no, because right I, here, I've reached the age. I, I'm more, <laughs> I am Marietta in the flesh. <laughs> I'm more agreeable than disagreeable. So I'm on yeah. more of your side, even though I agree with your. Way of looking at it, it's like yeah, yeah shun bad behavior. And, and it's I'm easy. To, it's easy it. to think that way. Yeah, right. It's very hard to act that right, way. That's right. why it was my New Year's resolution. <laughs> but I'm still struggling with it, it because is. you your automatic response is to be friendly right, to just someone. Be nice. Yeah, yeah. Be polite. And, yeah. But man, that one it caught me off guard because she spoke to me and I was just like, "Excuse <laughs> me, are you speaking to me? Like, <laughs> what is happening Sprechen right now?" Sprechen Sie Deutsch. Yeah. 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 I or go ahead. No, Kyle. that's all right. I was gonna <laughs> quote the Bible for a second oh. there, but oh, oh. Uh, thou shalt not kill. No, no. There's this line <laughs> in the. There's the, that's that's a good one though. No, there's this line that's in the Bible that basically says, you know, don't waste your words on swine. Mm-hmm. It's a really harsh oh. saying, but it's like, yeah, don't waste your time on. See, and that's like if I feel people. comfortable with you and I like like our relationship, yeah, I'll say something yeah. like, hey, man, like, Lighten don't up, hold buddy. back yeah. if I need criticism or critiquing or if like not criticism but critiquing yeah. don't criticize me um okay. actually don't even criti- critique me i don't like that uh, <laughs> Kelsey, i'm gonna you're confront doing a, everyone you're doing a great job Kelsey. <laughs> thanks, thanks man yeah but if i don't really care for you like i mean it's not even that i don't care maybe, for you i'm just like i don't maybe know you've you. never had anyone do something just truly vile to you one time my sister hit me with a golf club <laughs> That, but I mean, we're good. That's we're your good sister, now. Though, so that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ow. The kind of the, the blood. Yeah, that, you make a so. good point. I'm trying to think if anyone has ever really just, yeah, like I don't been think so. m- 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 uh, maniacal towards yeah. me. I'm trying yeah. to think if that's ever happened. Like, try to I think I'm the problem. Tear your family apart type Jesus, of stuff. Yeah. Jesus, man. Like, they're no. your best friend. Well, see, you have to remember try, yeah. that I've moved around a lot. Yeah. I guess that's that's my. It's always interesting to meet someone like you, mm-hmm. who's like, and my dad is this. My mom and dad are the same way. They grew up in the same exact town, mm-hmm. and they knew everyone for their entire like until their late twenties. Whereas mm-hmm. me. I had like a hundred different friends growing up of in different areas. Right. I'm not like a hundred is a, lo- a big number, but it's like mm-hmm. I never really grew those roots with mm-hmm. those people. So I met one mm-hmm. group of people for half a year, and then I moved on to the next one. Well, one of these people, it was less than a year. I mean, oh well, sure. You don't she have showed to know her them true colors. This is, true. this is why I have a hard time. I think making friends is That's because Aww, you make no. Up. It, it, well, it's because they it's always diary, end up diary. like <laughs> like just disappointing me. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Honestly, no one's good enough to no, be I my mean, friend. No, I, get, I get what you're saying. No. Yeah. Like you invest this time in a person and then they end up either doing something or just kind of being flaky. Or they're just a piece or, of dirt. Yeah. yeah. And so when I make friends, like if I'm good friends with you, it's like I've like we're really good friends. Right. You know there, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like right. I don't like having casual friends because I feel like it's a waste of time and it's hard to find Aww. people you want to invest your time into yeah and so yeah on it yeah i can yeah. see that because i don't i think i think i might be the problem <laughs> <laughs> i think i'm like oh my gosh am i the maniacal one <laughs> ah! Wait, what oh 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 okay, <laughs> she's i'm the, like trying to think i'm like mm-hmm. the bad apple <laughs> well you know you very well could be kelsey you know you did oh. insult me earlier and i'm still hurt by that just let it go i didn't mean <laughs> Get that over it. she didn't actually she didn't actually insult me it's fine no. <clears throat> he, you could take it as a compliment what, what she said no definitely not <laughs> gonna take it as a compliment i'll just take it as an as a statement <laughs> not and we will leave it at that <laughs> what about the term killing them with kindness what do you stand on with i'm that? all about that that's Killing my more kindness? that's more my philosophy oh. is that just depends the, on the situation oh. i have rarely found where that's what i want to do <laughs> i <laughs> don't, don't think do i yeah. get my point across See, <laughs> <laughs> so my mom is super passive aggressive well yeah she was uh now she doesn't care but she she would sit there and just like i remember one time she was like mad at my dad and she only packed like a shirt for him when we were like going out and he was like, what? 
I'm sorry. I, 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 I apologize, but you still only packed a shirt. <laughs> It's like, I thought these suitcases were super light, but... Uh, so I really want to meet your mom. She is a character. Oh, my gosh. She she needs to come on the podcast to be on. Actually, I don't know. We can no. call her up right now. No. I got her. Nope. Uh, but, so, like, the, but I don't agree with the passive... Ag- Hold on one second. Turn it off. <laughs> Turn it off. Turn it off. Hang it up now. Hello? Uh... <laughs> Uh, but I don't believe in the passive aggressive way because I, if I want, I believe in being aggressive, not a passive well, see, aggressive. Well, see, and that's why, like here, and I think over time, I've I've learned there's like to be passive aggressive in certain situations, and so Duffy keeps telling me I'm being passive aggressive, and it's like, well, because with you, I can't be uh, straight up aggressive. So, yeah. and I, you know, and when I need to say something. <laughs> This that's the only way I know how to do it. See, my sister, you know? she can go. Oh, and she's told me because I, I was like mad at like Maverick or something where I just wouldn't text him. And my you think s- as a female that that's something we do because I we're intimidated know. and so we're just like kind of passive aggressive. Well, I here we go. I <laughs> was just Kyle, trying to what? make a point. Stop being quiet. But he, but Sim, she's she can sit there and she. Don't text him. I won't text for weeks. I was like, but how do they know they're mad? you're mad at them <laughs> if I don't tell? <laughs> hey, I am mad at you. you yeah. know, it's, it's funny that you say that because as a guy, if if a female that I'm attracted to isn't texting me, I go, oh, I guess she must be busy. Yeah, no, I know. And that's <laughs> exactly, <laughs> that is exactly yeah. my point. It's like, she's not mad at me. She's so, just busy. So why were you having to, to cover huh? your mouth a minute ago? I don't know what you're talking about. When I said that females are intimidated, so they're passive aggressive to get their point across. What are your thoughts on that? But yeah. see, I'm not. I don't think I'm intimidated. <laughs> I, I when I I'm either intimidated, or I know I could. I know, like for instance, like in a working situation, I'm not intimidated like physically or anything like that. Mm. But I know I don't hold a place of of like power. There you and go. so I know I can't come in demanding, uh, yeah. you know, and so I got it like, there okay, you go. this is what I think. I think like, we're just smarter. Sometimes yeah, it, have is, to think sometimes it, it is because I'm just intimidated and I don't want to rile them up. So I just like, you know. Well, see, I, if something like I don't sit and think about things, I'll just like, as soon as I'll triple 500 time text just because that's on my mind, like dick, 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 how I think. Huh? You guys have seen it a couple of times when I like message in the group, and it's just oh, and you start like <laughs> yeah. you start like talking about your yeah. inner feelings well, and such. Yeah, no, but that's how I feel. And so, like when uh, someone doesn't like confront me, like my friend and I, we got into it. But she was taking a step back and thinking about what was happening, and I was like, let's just let's just do this. Let's go. <laughs> She's like, whoa. So, so what do y'all think? We should just shun yeah, people shun, in yeah. society? Shun bad people. Yes, absolutely. Okay. Uh, so can y'all practice that and then tell me how it turns out? I don't want to. Can we practice it? <laughs> like at the like at the store or oh. the, the other day I was trying to get by at the game and this man is just standing in the doorway blocking it. Mm-hmm. And I was like trying to get around and so the man was there and I was like, excuse me. And then like squeezed past him like real obvious and so the other man like kind of like laughed because it was obvious that man was being rude yep. Yep. and i could have been like oh sir excuse me you know but i was just like obvious like you're being rude like, and hey, i'm letting your, you know get your butt mm. out of the way which was a passive aggressive way of handling it that's all right yeah, there's just so many ways to handle it but that kind of thing in the store or on the road like when people are being rude like on me and i went to get food and this lady didn't let me get over and so I threw my hands up at her. So just stuff like that, you know. I think we should do oh, more I, of that. I do yeah, that anyways. We should. Let's just let's all kill Caesar. <laughs> okay, so if you're listening, uh take note and maybe take notes of your current doings and tell us how it goes. You know, are you less irritated, more irritated? Are people treating you better? Let let us know if this uh not about how they're treating you. It's just you feel better. This is okay. Well, Cuz you're not holding it in and being like, "Oh, or just kill him with kindness. We'll see how it goes.